So, yan ulit yung plan natin sa PLDT. Fiber 20 Mbps. Tara, sama mo ako sandali. Ha? Bakit? Okay. Papademand ako sila. 20 Mbps plan natin. Tapos 2 Mbps lang ang download speed. Mga d*** ko pala sila. Sumulog ka dun, ha? Ha? Uy, bali! Sorry, bago lang soundboard operator namin. Sinabi. So what's up guys, and today is gonna be a quick video on something that still confuses a lot of people even today. And that's the difference between Megabyte, Big B, and Megabit, Small B, and why you should know it. So just a short introduction. Byte is completely different from bit, take note. In every byte, there are 8 bits. So if your internet connection is 50 megabits per second, small b, which is advertised by your ISPs or your internet service providers, 50 divided by 8 is equals to 6.25 megabytes per second, big b, of effective download speeds. So remember, there's a huge difference between small b and big b. Then that means false advertising, right? No. Bit is a term used mainly for internet connection speeds and not data transfer speeds. While byte, on the other hand, is used for data transfer transfer speeds, storage, and download speeds. Yeah. So technically, your ISP isn't false advertising but is rather using a marketing strategy and it makes a lot of sense. 50 Mbps is more appealing than 6.25 Mbps, right? Well, obviously, duh. And that's mainly the gist of it. So before pulling the trigger, complaining, or even filing a lawsuit, check if it's small b bits or big b bytes. For example, you're looking for a new ISP, and you saw that they're offering up to 100 Mbps of internet connection speeds. Notice how ISPs just say Mbps instead of megabits or megabytes when talking to you or in a commercial. And you're like... <laughs> And then BAM! You're disappointed when you come home and that's the marketing strategy. You're quickly convinced by the high number without realizing the actual value of it. Hashtag medyo hugot. It's also applicable in humans. This is bit and this is part. So again and again, megabit, small b, and megabyte, big b. In every byte, there are 8 bits. So just divide your internet connection speed by 8. Of course, considering that your ISP use the term megabit or mbps, small b. I think ISPs don't really use megabytes or big b. And you'll know what you're paying for. And hopefully this video helped you guys um, clear the confusion and probably your hate for your ISP. So leave a like, share with a friend to enlighten them, and uh, if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. As always, bookmark and use my Lazada affiliate link when buying at Lazada as a way to support my channel. Don't worry as this won't have any additional charges to your purchase. It just gives me a small kickback every time you use my link when buying at Lazada. And if you don't mind donating at all, I'll also so leave the link to my Patreon in the description of this video. Also, follow me on Twitter for updates on the channel. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.